what was your your inspiration or your your point of view for your your twentieth record? What what really were you trying to say? Well, I really wanted the uh, the album "You Gotta Love the Life" mm -hmm. to reflect what I have learned and what I know to be true, and I also wanted it to represent the variety of types of music that I perform all the time that right. I'm interested in. Um, that, you know, I, I don't want it to sound like sour grapes. I've had a lot of success and a lot of failure with mm -hmm. great record companies and mm -hmm. great producers. But be that as it may, there was always that sticking point of needing to, for them, to have to categorize you so it would be easier for them to sell you. Mm -hmm. And, uh, and while I understand that point of view, it's very limiting. Right. Because on stage I perform all sorts of music and songs occur to me from the stage. And your audience connects with all they those get it. styles. They and, get it. Yes. You know, nobody gets into a trauma right. by listening mm -hmm. to all kinds of music. Mm -hmm. And so to be able to create a musical scope was lovely and liberating and, and it, it reinforced the authenticity of the musical journey. Mm -hmm. yeah. I think we accomplished that. We we did, my dear. We and, did. And you have a lot to say I at this this point of your not your career mm -hmm. only, but your life. Mm -hmm. You have a strong point of view, and it's one of the things that that I admire and connect with you as a friend and as an artist. Mm -hmm. So I was curious to to um, reveal that. To, to see with, with the entire album, but also with each song. Mm -hmm. What do you, and we, we would have this conversation, what are you trying to say? How do you envision this? How do you? Exactly. And, and that was a, a, a really uh, beautiful part of the process. It was, it that, was. In making this record. It was because each song has its own world. And, and you know, you can feel when it gets set. Right. You know, and right. that was beautiful. It was beautiful. Mm -hmm. It was beautiful. Uh, describe the experience of hearing your songs sung and played by some of the musical giants that graced us with their very generous uh, talent and time and heart. What was that like? Well, for instance, uh, Other End of the Phone, yeah. which, um, which was so multi-layered with, with honor for me. Uh, because I set to music Hal David's last lyric, and um, and through you, Joe Sample agreed to make time in his very busy schedule yeah. to record mm -hmm. and to fly down to Houston because he had health challenges, and to hear him put his hands on a piano and that sound, that Joe Sample sound, you hear it from the first chord, and it, it, it was so startling, yes. because I've been trying to work with him for 30 years, yes. and you know he was busy and whatever, but, but there it is, you're, you're in the room with that mm -hmm. person who makes that definitive piano mm -hmm. sound, it was, uh, it was thrilling. Yeah, I really wanted you to experience that, sitting Thank next you. to him on a piano bench. Yes. Because, um, yeah, I worked with Joe yes. early on in my yes. career, and yeah. we spent a lot of late nights, me sitting next to him on a piano bench, watching this music just just explode out of his yes. fingers from the dirt, Yeah, even and, quietly. Yeah, yeah, and, and you know, he was, he was clearly having health challenges, yes. and he said to me, he said, you know, I was going to compose the whole thing through, uh -huh. and then I thought the night before, just, just let's see what happens right. in the room, Good. and it was the best choice. Yeah. yeah. I'm glad. I'm really glad we made that. That was happen. great, and then of course to have Dion sing the yeah, song that, that was with me was so interesting because this song could have been um, regarded as a conventional male-female duet. I mean, it was not written as a duet, mm -hmm. but but to have two women singing on it, it it expanded the inner life of the song. It did. I thought. Yeah, yeah. It took on more. I think so. Even more. Yeah. Just call me, and I'll be.
turn to gray. 